Are you a real estate agent and you're looking to scale your lead generation? Well, if you are, you're in the right place because in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to attract more leads using Facebook ads. So how do you scale your lead generation? Well, before we talk about some scalable activities, let's talk about the reasons why things aren't scalable and some of the activities that you might be doing now that aren't scalable. Uh, so really when it comes down to scaling, you need to be able to have three things that you can scale. One is your money. You want to scale your money. So the money you invest into an activity, you want that to get a maximum return. Uh, the next one is your time. You want to scale your time. You don't want to do one-on-one -on -one kind of meetings all the time. You want to do one-to-many where you can reach many people simultaneously as opposed to just one person. And finally, one of the most important things as an agent is your energy. You know, how much energy do you have in the day, in the week, in the month? And you need to focus that energy in the right activities that give you a maximum return. So you want to scale the energy that you put into your lead generation activities. And so let's go through a few activities that you may be doing now that I believe aren't scalable. So the first one are letterbox drops. Now, when you look at them from the, uh, you know, just... When you look at an average letterbox shop, you say, yeah, it's scalable. I can reach 20,000, 40,000 homes in my local area. But is the money scalable? So you may be able to get a, a big reach, but the return on investment is, is normally quite small for that money you put in. So you might put $2,000 into a letterbox drop that reaches 20,000 people, but what return are you getting for that $2,000? Can you get a better return on investment and scale that money? Uh, another, another activity that you might be doing is networking. So going to networking events. And again, very, very effective. And I'm not saying don't do letterbox drops. I'm not saying don't do networking, but I'm saying, can you add some scalable activities to this? Because networking is really a one-on-one -on -one activity. So you go to a networking event on one night, you take yourself along and you might meet you know, five or 10 people and you have one-on-one -on -one conversations and you might get a lead out of that or you might get nothing. But the problem is your time is not being scalable. It's not being scaled. And so you only have a limited amount of time and you're investing that into an activity that may or may not see results. Again, I'm not saying don't do it. I'm just saying, is it scalable? Another activity that you might be doing that I believe isn't scalable uh, is door knocking. You know, going around your local neighborhood and knocking on doors. Again, not saying don't do it, but it takes a lot of time and a lot of energy. And so uh, you, can, uh, you might be able to reach 20 or 30 homes in the day and you might have you know, 10 or five conversations and you might have one or two meaningful conversations, but then your whole day is taken up doing that. And finally, we have cold calling. You know, cold calling has been termed as soul destroying for uh, some people. And uh, you know, whether you are the best salesman in your company or the worst salesman or in the middle, cold calling is always difficult. And so don't think that cold calling is meant to be easy. Uh, it is hard, it's tough, and you can see a return on investment in it. But I don't believe it's as scalable as some other tactics out there. So they're kind of four activities that I believe aren't scalable, but are necessary for a real estate agent. So why don't we talk about now how to add something that's much more scalable and add that to the mix of the things you're doing. And for me, that's Facebook ads. Facebook ads ticks all the boxes when it comes to scalability. You know, when it comes to your money, you get a really good return on investment for the money you spend. You know, you are able to put as little as $5 a day uh, on Facebook to advertise a post or a property or to try and attract uh, uh, listing leads. And so that's like $35 a week. And for that, you can reach literally thousands of people in your local area with that ad. So show that ad to them. Now, whether you can convert those uh, people into leads is how good you are at Facebook ads. But I can tell you now, it's very, very scalable. So $35 for a few thousand people is much better than uh, you know $2,000 for 20,000 people. So Facebook ads are very scalable when it comes to money, but they're also scalable when it comes to time because the investment you need to make into running Facebook ad campaigns compared to cold calling and the reach that you get out of that or door knocking and the reach you get out of that is so much more. I would recommend that you always use an agency to do 
uh, your Facebook advertising because I believe that agencies like myself um, have done it before. They, they can get you the quickest return on the investment and get you leads quicker than you could yourself, but you can do it yourself. Just expect a learning curve and expect to spend quite a bit of time investing into it. But even that time that you invest into Facebook ads, if you do it yourself, is nothing compared to the time you have to invest into networking and cold calling and door knocking. And once you get good at it, then you can scale your time out. So you might spend an hour on an ad or two hours on an ad and literally reach thousands or tens of thousands of people depending on how much money you spend. So Facebook ads are very good with scaling your time. And finally, your energy. Uh, Your energy as a salesperson is something that you should really protect and focus in the right areas. And so Conserving that energy is really important and that passion, I'm kind of talking about passion here, you know, the get up and go in the morning when you get up and you say, I'm going to make those calls, I'm going to, you know, speak to those people, I'm going to go and knock on doors. You need to focus that energy in the right places and when you can use that energy to run some ads that get a big reach, it kind of builds more energy and it builds more momentum for you and when you see your company Uh, reaching lots of people in the community and getting lots of leads back and appointments that you can then get on the phone and call and you haven't put a lot of time or money into it. It does build momentum in the business that can really propel you and your team forward. So in this series of videos, I'm going to show you how you can actually use Facebook to scale your lead generation. So watch the videos. I hope you get excited about the possibilities for your agency. So if what I'm saying to you is making sense and you think that Facebook ads is kind of the next best step for your business to grow your lead generation, then I suggest you book in a strategy session with me. So you can go to marlinmarisha.com slash strategy. You can book in a 45 minute call where we'll look at your business, we'll look at your goals and we'll see how Facebook can help you achieve those goals. And at the end of that call, if there's an opportunity that I believe that we could work together, that I can help you reach those goals, I'll let you know the next steps. But if I think that there's a better option for you, I will then refer you on and point you in the right direction. So look, you've got nothing to lose. There's no cost. Book in a strategy session with me at marlinmarisha.com slash strategy. And hopefully we'll have a chat and talk about how we can grow your lead generation and the sales in your real estate company.